Yo, 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 what's going up? Facebook Live, man, it's your boy Randy. Checking in one time, a.k.a. Sino, however you may know me. Um, squeezing in one more time. I'm going to give some people some time to jump in the room. Uh, just speaking to you guys who are checking out the replay. Hey, <laughs> what's cracking, what's shaking? Um, yeah, man, today we're talking about faking it won't make it. And I'm pretty sure a lot of y'all probably already know where I'm going with this. But I'm going anyway. I got to go anyway. So I'm going to wait and see... Um, who steps into the room. When you come in, make sure you let me know where you're watching from. Uh, drop your favorite emoji. We're going to crank this thing up. Yeah, you already know what it is. Faking it won't make it. And like I said, a lot of y'all probably already know what I'm talking about. So uh, we're going to give it a little time for some more people to come in and see if we can't get this number to jump. So when you come in, uh, make sure you drop where you're watching from. Uh, drop your favorite emoji. If you want to share this with some of your friends or share this with your teams, if you uh, have teams that you're building or whatnot, and you want to explain to them that being your authentic self is truth, is life, then this is the video uh, or live that you would want to share. So share it. And when you share it, make sure that you um, actually uh, put in the comments that you did share so that I can give you a shout out. Uh, what's going on, Janita? We on here talking about faking it won't make it, man. Faking it won't make it. Like I said, a lot of y'all probably got a good idea of what this is, man. It's basically saying be your authentic self. Be you. Be the true you, your authentic self. What's going on, Rochelle? How you doing? Um, yeah, man. Be the true you. Uh, for one reason, man, is this. How long are you going to pretend to be someone else? You know, I'd rather be an imperfect me than uh, be a perfect someone else. You know what I mean? Why would I pretend to be someone else when I can be an imperfect me and make all the possible mistakes I can make? Because you learn from your mistakes, right? And that's the craziest thing about mistakes. We learn from our mistakes, but so many people are so afraid to make them. That's crazy. But so eager to learn. Backwards. But anyhow, like I said, man, um, that's real. That's real, that's real. You learn from your mistakes. You just got to, uh, you know what I'm saying? You just got to not be afraid to go make those mistakes. Got to not be afraid to go make those mistakes. But be who you are, the authentic you. You never want to have to pull that blanket back and show the real you at the last minute. And then the people that have been following you for so long absolutely hate the real you. Or maybe you absolutely in the long run end up becoming to hate the person that you're pretending to be and you just want to be yourself finally. Well, you can't do that after you put on this persona, you played this game so long to be pretend to be this one person. Everyone knows you for that person. They fall in love with that person. You build that, built that fame as that person. Faking it won't make it. At one point in your life, you're gonna have to take that. Uh, you're gonna have to take that. Uh, that veil off, raise the veil, and allow people to see you. You're gonna have to raise that curtain and allow people to see the real you. Just like the Wizard of Oz. Uh, the Wiz. I mean, you think about it. When they, he was this big, great, great figure that they, you know, what I'm saying they believed was. You know, this big, big man, you know, and then when they went behind it was a man working like a, a puppet master, right? So you got to you gotta make sure that you're being your authentic self. You'll attract the type of people that you want to have around you, the type of people that you want to grow business with, the type of people that you will want your family around because you have to be your authentic self, man. You have to be. You have to be. Uh, the same way with relationships, man. Quit faking it. Stop faking in these relationships. A lot of people, I, be, I believe you when you say you're in love. Yeah, you love that person, but you don't like the person you're with. It's sad. You love the person, but don't like the person you're with. The only reason why you have this person in your life is because you don't want to see anybody else with that person. Or you don't want to be lonely. You don't know how to get out there and start living your life. because that's, And so you decide that you want to fake it. You can't do that. That's selfish. That is so selfish for you to fake that. For you to sit there and have somebody... That's, really, that's holding someone hostage. Uh, leading them on to believe that... Uh, that that your love is that deep and your love and it's not you like you love that person but you don't like that person you know and, and it's crazy it's I found a lot of instances where I had to check that myself where it's like man you know what do I really do I really like this person though there's a difference you can love someone and not like them not like anything about them you can't the minute they walk in the room you oh my god I can't believe that you know I've been there you know don't even want to touch them but when they're away it's like you, you love everything about them. You have to let it go. You have to get over it. You have to get over that and start living your life, man. You can't fake it. Faking it will not make it. It will not make it. You remember, uh, I don't know if a lot of you might not even be old enough to remember Millie Vanilli. Back when uh, lip singing was, was a thing, you couldn't, lip singing was like the most horrible thing you can do. Now all these artists are lip singing. None of them have a lick of talent. But back then, they were faking it. They were lip singing and lip singing. And they got caught. Ruined their careers. They faked it, did not make it. You can't fake it until you make it, man. 
If LeBron faked like he was an awesome basketball player, come on, how far do you think he would have gotten? You know, if, if, yeah, Britney Spears, exactly. I mean, <laughs> exactly. That's a prime example. You, you fake it, and, and now you see less of those people are embarrassed. They want to be themselves. They want to be able to step out and be themselves now. That's why you see a lot of artists, they have these downfalls, or they, or they act out, or they blow up, and they become these crazy monsters that media projects them to be. It's because these record labels have built them up, built up this persona, this fake, uh, this fake image of a person, uh, the, and everybody's buying it. Everybody's out buying these records. It's not even the, it's not even that person. You go buy the records, you're not buying the real Chris Brown. You go buy uh, uh, Br uh, Britney Spears records, you're not buying the real Britney Spears. Don't how don't dive into these records and believe that these people are doing, especially on a pop level. A lot of them are not living the lives that they're singing about. On a pop level, you can almost ninety percent of the time count on it not being. Uh, original. You can count on it being written by somebody. It's not, it's not, okay. There you go with J-Lo. J-Lo is real. Okay. All right, I'm going to leave J-Lo alone because I know you, you, uh, <laughs> you'll be in my messenger trying to kill me about J-Lo. But no, real talk. Don't fake it, man. You cannot fake it and make it. It is impossible to fake it and make it. We've had presidents that have faked, faked it and tried to make it and, and, it shows once they hit the White House. Once that, I'm telling you, once that curtain peels back, man, and you have to really get out there and get it. You, you know, like that's just like me. If I was to tell everybody, man, oh yeah, I, when I get on stage, I'm an awesome performer. I know how to command the crowd, and then I get on stage, and everybody shows up, and I get on stage, and I just stand there in the middle and never take the mic off the stand. You know what I mean? Like I ain't gonna make it. That'll be my last show, guaranteed. You can't fake it. Faking it will not get you there. It will not get you there. You can't. You can't say that you're authentic. You a real one. You know. You like to say you a real one. Uh, you do this. You take care of your business, and, and you get down a certain way. Well, guess what? It's gonna come out, man. It's gonna come out. Everything's gonna come out. You can't fake it. Faking it will not allow you to make it. And that's and that's just real. You know. I mean, uh, my thing. What I used to always like to do. I, I and I was real good. I I let people assume a lot of things. You know, but I would never open my mouth and tell anybody anything that wasn't true about me. I couldn't. It's, it's just, come on, one day you got to live up to it. You got to live up to it every day. If I, if I tell you I'm a certain type of person, I have to be that person every day. I can't forget one day and you say, oh, I thought you didn't, oh, I thought you didn't eat me. Like, oh, I forgot. <laughs> you know, like you can't, you can't fake it and make it. You know what I mean? Like it, it doesn't work like that. Oh, I, oh, I thought you had, to, I thought you had a job. I thought you had to work. Oh yeah, that's right. You're right. How? How how somebody else write about your job before you are? You can't fake it and make it, bro. You gotta be authentic. You gotta be that real, you know. And it 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 goes all the way down to it, man. It's gonna be an instance where they're gonna, where your car is gonna be pulled. And if you plan to fake it, then you have to have that note know that you're gonna have to face those consequences at some point. You have to be prepared for those consequences. I hope you got some kind of plan B uh, gymmed up for when they find out that you're faking. Because I don't know what kind of fan base, what kind of uh, friends you're going to be able to pull after. What kind of friends are you going to have if all of your friends came and, be, and became friends with the fake you? Your, the real you has no friends. No friends. And that's real. See, I'm happy with, I'm happy. See, a lot, a lot of times you have to go find the real you. A lot of times you don't even know you're faking it. You know what I mean? A lot of times a lot of people have been living this life for so long, they don't even know that they're faking it. Until that one day that they grow up and they and they find themselves alone, you know, you find yourself alone and you don't even recognize yourself. You don't even you you don't even know what you like to do. All you know is you sit at the house all the time. You get on Facebook, and and I see them. I see posting every ten minutes, every three minutes. It's like, come on, man, how could you have that much information to post about but you never get out? You faked it long enough. You got so much fake news to post. It's just it's sad, you know. So it's like. <laughs> It's sad, man. So keep it real from the jump, man. Keep it real from the gate, and you never have to worry about it in the end. Like they say, if you stay ready, you never have to get ready. If you come in being real, come in being 100, you never have to be questioned about being 100 ever. Never. And so many people hollering they 100 nowadays, I don't even holler I'm 100. I'm, I'm, a, I'm a thousand at everything I do. Never 100. There's so many fake people hollering 100. It's like, shh. All right. That's not real beef. You know, so I'm... <laughs> So I'm like, a real talk. So you got you to gotta watch those. And not only just you faking it, you got to watch those that are around you that are faking it. 
You got to watch those that are around that are, that are faking it to make it into your circle. I've been around a few of those that, that I thought that would have my back in a situation. And then when uh, that situation, when any situation came, they were nowhere to be found. Or maybe they were to be found, but nowhere, no, nowhere as, uh, as far as support. So watch those people, man, that fake it. They will never make it. And you should never let them make it. Anytime you catch them faking it, you should call them out on it. You should sit them down on it. Don't let them get bold with that fake shit. Make sure you call them out on it. You know what I mean? That, that, that's you being real. That's you being the real you. Would you like for somebody to keep putting, uh, putting fake content in front of you and you buying into it thinking that this person is authentic? You know what I'm saying? Are you putting this person in your in in your in your list of people that you that you cool with? I cool with this dude and you and everybody else know he fake but you. Everybody else already been exposed. He's already exposed himself to everybody else, but you. So make sure you do your do your uh, research on these people that you follow and these people that you uh that you have around you, man. You know, make sure you even check yourself out to make sure you authentic. Because a lot, of, like I said, a lot of times people don't even know they they fake themselves. You know, they think they live in that life. Let me get some likes. Let me get some loves, man. If you're in the room, if you're checking it out, if um, if you're watching from outside the page, man, click it, open it up, get involved. Uh, come join me, man. I usually do this around. I'm trying to find my time right now. I'm going to start cranking them up back around 930 like I was doing before, but I just want to make sure I'm able to hit everybody. What's going on, Chaz? Appreciate you for stepping in. What's going on, Nita? Yeah, man, I'm just I'm just giving the business on. on I, I don't ever have a script, so if y'all got any comments... Uh, strike them in the in the comments, man. I love to communicate with y'all. I don't go by script. I just kind of freestyle it off of my my life experiences, things that are, things that have kind of helped me along my journey, things that I might have went through today or something I might have looked outside and saw on Facebook. I just go at it because apparently it's a problem yet. So I'm, you know, just just trying to see if I could fill some type of void that might be there because I see a lot of people going through a lot of things. I mean, hell, I go through stuff too. You know, like I go through stuff too. So I need to. I outlet myself. So, I mean, anything you guys want to discuss, if you had a situation, if anybody's ever had somebody you thought that was really authentic uh, turn out to be fake, drop a one in the comments, matter of fact. Type a one in the comments. If you had somebody you really thought was an authentic person, was a real person, come to find out to be fake, and it just really blew your mind that that person wasn't as real as you thought, drop a one in the comments for me. Because that's happened to me plenty of times. You know, like, I've, I've, I've had to crack the code on a lot of these cats plenty of times, man. And it's and I'm not gonna lie, I was not happy with with the result. Like I was really rooting for the rooting for him and hoping that you know <laughs> that he would be authentic and and, and make out for. It. Cause I mean, but it, it was it, too good to be true in the first place. I was like, man, how, how come? How is, are me and him so compatible? We rock and do the same things together. Everything I do, he cool with. He like now. Nah, me and him didn't like life the same. I loved life. He didn't really he didn't really love life like I did. You know what I mean? Like. I, I was finding myself always uh, in a bad situation when I was around him. Always. You know what I mean? But 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 he claimed to be a stand-up guy, but he always had me in some crazy shit all the time. You know? And um, and those of you that are new are going to be checking out my lives. Every now and then, I'm going to throw you some profanity because, for one, it's me. You know what I mean? So if you're checking into me, you're going to get a little bit every now and then because I like to keep it authentic. I'm not going to sit up here and fake for y'all to act like I don't get out like that. So... That is it. And I'm also going to put another thing out. I believe in spirit. spirituality is, is deep. I feel like it, everyone should be able to dig into their faith. Me, myself, I don't do religion. So everyone's welcome to my page. Uh, I know a lot of people like get in my inbox and uh, want to have religion war with me, but and I, I don't entertain it whatsoever. Like I say, man, I'm, I'm open book. I'll discuss anything on the table if it's interesting enough. Right now, it's these fake people. There's so many fake people running around. You got fake Instagrams. You got fake Facebook. You got people catfishing. Like, what is what is going on? Like, I'm not understanding. You got fake asses. You got... <laughs> I mean, what is going on, man? You know, it's it's like it's like being real is, is, is scarce. Like, it's hard to find a real one nowadays. I only got a few. I only got a few real ones that I could really... That I could really trust nowadays, man. It's crazy. But... You know, I just wanted to pop in, man, and really get y'all the business on, you know, how I feel about people being fake, you know. There ain't no room for it. There's no need for you to be fake. Be real. You know, I want to know the real you. So, stop holding people hostage in relationships. Stop holding them hostage in, the, in, your, in y'all's relationships, man. Um, if you love them and don't like them, let him go. Same for you, bro. If you love her and don't like her, let her go. Let her live. Let her be free. Let her be happy with somebody. You know what I mean? Um... 
Stop hold stop holding your partners hostage. You know, for real. Be real with them. Be authentic with your friends. Be authentic with your clients. Be authentic with your be real with yourself. Put real food inside your body that's gonna help you flourish. I always tell you every day, every time I get on live, I'm gonna tell you to eat healthy. So you know you're not gonna miss it today. Eat healthy always, always, always. It's important. It's very important. Health and wealth go hand in hand. So you gotta stay healthy, stay wealthy. <laughs> well I gave you that one. Stay healthy, stay blessed, stay humble. Peace. Check you tomorrow.